Mr. President, the ICJ welcomes the acceptance by Tajikistan of the recommendations by Armenia, Uzbekistan, Australia and Canada to ensure an independent judiciary and the right to a fair trial. Yet, the ICJ notes that despite multiple judicial reforms, the judiciary in Tajikistan is not independent. Self-governing bodies of the judiciary are weak, and individual judges remain highly vulnerable to pressures from within or outside the judiciary. Judges are not able to adjudicate cases independently, and court precedents influence decisions making in all cases. These deficiencies have real consequences for human rights protection, including the fairness of court proceedings, resulting in almost no acquittals in criminal proceedings. The ICJ further welcomes the acceptance of recommendation by Norway to ensure that lawyers are guaranteed full independence and safety. The ICJ regrets, however, that Tajikistan did not accept the recommendations by Ukraine, France, Luxembourg, calling to stop interference with an independent work of lawyers and release those detained. In practice, lawyers are often facing harassment for carrying out their professional duties. Since 2015, a number of lawyers have been sentenced to lengthy prison terms on bogus charges of fraud, corruption and other crimes, likely for political motives. Tajikistan should implement a comprehensive judicial reform which allows for the independent administration of justice by judges who are capable of protecting human rights. Lawyers should be able to carry out their professional duties without intimidation, hindrance, harassment or improper interference. I thank you.